Yep. Session number two for our client here. We're doing the anterior section of the bicep. She was using Enlocrine the first uh, time. This time she's using uh, the um, topical anesthetic that we offer here, which is from Zensa. How are you doing there? Good. Good, good. There's some sensitive areas, I'm sure, but doing much better than from when you use that other stuff. Yes. Yeah, this time not as much blanching as the first time, but you'll see some whitening of the tissue. Oh, hi guys, uh, just finished doing another tattoo removal session on somebody. Uh, I just thought I'd take a moment and um, endorse a product. Uh, it's funny because I, I don't usually like to say anything's the bomb unless I totally believe in it. And I kind of waited on this last one um, only because um, y you, you can't really make a decision on these things until you've got uh, enough studies on it or feedback from clients and stuff. So. Um, this last client, I thank you. Either just watch the, the video or you will be watching the video. I haven't decided how I'm going to edit these videos. Um, but you'll notice that um, she barely budged. It was pretty awesome. Um, I have tried um, doing tattoo removal sessions with uh, laser um, on people who use Emla cream or other topical anesthetics. I got to say that um, after giving a try on uh, the Zensa product here, the from Malira. It's a topical anesthetic that is uh, available to professionals. Um, pretty awesome. Uh, she, uh, this last time she used this as opposed to the Emla, and what a difference it was. Um, she said she can still feel a little bit of a biting or nipping kind of sensation but the heat's definitely not there it's not sharp she totally stayed put for the whole session it was nowhere near um sensitive uh, than it was with even the emla cream so anyways um shout out to these guys Alira, uh for the zensa product uh, that's my watch telling me i gotta go do something yep hold on okay done um, yeah, and uh, yeah, that's about it. You guys have a great day.